great God, it's a fantastic day. It's a good day to be alive. <laughs> Come to think of it, every day is a good day to be alive. All right, guys. So I'm like walking my dog, you know, and playing Pokemon Go right now. It is Halloween, gang. It's Halloween, bro. It's hella early. It's hella cold. How you doing? <laughs> It's Halloween, it's hella cold, and if you guys don't know, it's your boy B-Day, man. I don't really celebrate my B-Day like that, so it's my birthday. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe, gang. Like, comment, subscribe. I'm live streaming on TikTok right now. We got two people in there. Not too many people, just because I haven't been on the Pokemon Go in a long time, but I decided today is the best day to do it. On my birthday, Halloween, they got a Halloween themed on this bitch. Let's go, gang. Let's go. And y'all know we gotta toke it up. Y'all know we gotta toke it up. And it's like hella wet outside because it's been like raining. It's been like raining, so it's hella like wet out here right now. But it looks beautiful as hell outside today. All right, guys. Cheers. This is the Lux Max. What? My cousin had this pin, it's called the Lux Max. Y'all remember, I had one of the Lux pins myself. I didn't know they made a Max version, so shout out to Yokan, they made a a, 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 a a Max version that's way bigger than the Lux, the, the regular Lux, it's funny as fuck. <laughs> All right guys. We're at fucking McDonald's, eh? Just got some McDonald's. And vape time. Well, I ain't here to talk about cigars. The first hit I did was was um a raw garden cartridge. Next hit, we got the vape. You know the vibes. You ever see a chicken with his neck on? Laying to the side, old legs and weak. But I decided to just go to McDonald's or something real quick. But I got a fucking pee test today, guys. What the hell? On my birthday. Oh, well. Yeah, I know what you're saying to me. I don't care what you're talking about. Bernie Mac crew, Bernie Mac beat his kids. I don't care. So we're going to go down there. That's your opinion. Take a pee test. You don't know what went down. I got to take my dog back home, so I'm probably going to take him back home. Cheers. Take a quick little shower. Cause you stole from. You know what I'm saying? And then. I'm gonna turn you in. America, let's talk. Yeah, my sister's on drugs. That's okay. Some of your family members messed up too. I don't know what I'm gonna do. What am I supposed to do? Allow these three I might go to the movies. I might not, but I'm definitely gonna go get some trees. You know what I'm saying? I gotta get me a little half ounce, to maybe some wax. And then, that's all I'm trying to say. Or oh, they got to sit there and share food with four other kids. I'm getting baked today. Oh, I'm trying to do the right thing. Filming? Sometimes the right thing may not be the right thing. But I'm gonna do the right thing. Just be careful. But hell yeah, guys, I hope you guys are getting big with me. Also, eat with your boy. Like I always say, remember to eat, breathe, smoke, weed. I need to charge and how am I going to explain to ATT that I'm late for work again? I got to show y'all my, my AVB or already vape bud AVB. Yeah, I got to show y'all. I put it in a different jar so it's like better and I can fill up way more. I put it in this little jar. It says fuck being high on it. Or fuck I'm high. I'm tripping. I said fuck being high. What? Fuck being high? Who, who wants to say fuck being high? Like, come on, guys. But it says, fuck, I'm high on it, which is pretty cool. I gotta clean it off a little bit, though. Alright, I'm about to eat, guys.
All right, guys. Just got done picking up from the most beautiful spot to pick up from, and this guy is coming in on the wrong way. It's the one over, man. What are you doing? Creepo crazy. There's two entrances. This one is exit. The other one is an entrance. He just went through the exit. But yeah, this is the most beautiful fucking spot to be get to get the goodies, man. To get the fucking goodies. So I'm basically off. I'm about to go. Um, God damn, that dude's car did not sound good. I don't know if y'all guys could hear that. This dude's car was like whistling. But um, it's beautiful as fuck, guys. As you guys can see. But um, fucking, I gotta go take a P test. So we're headed to go take a P test. And then I'll probably show you guys what I got. Maybe even roll up or something. I don't know. But we outside, baby. I gotta take a P test. I gotta take a P test. For what? For a job. Uh, they are not here today. They are not this there. This is the lab. So uh, they told uh, me to come today. Come today for what interview? No, P test. A P test. Okay. First, uh, who sent you here? And no recording. Okay. All right. I'm just. All right, guys, we back. P test done. Cheers. Lucky for California, they don't test for the herb. Get a quick dab. I actually bought some rosin too. The rosin just tastes way better than the CBX doesn't taste bad, but rosin just tastes better. This is CBX like um, sugar. All right, guys, let's go. Gang. We, we living in the future, gang. What? This thing is a laptop. Like what? A laptop phone, gang. Laptop phone. It's a Razor too. Haven't seen Razor in a long time, but we're at Best Buy. You already know. I'm trying to see if they have a, a light for the GoPro. So we're gonna check that out. Um, but yeah. It's not that busy because it's the weekday. Doesn't seem like that many people, but let's go. Whoa. We're gonna see what this is working with like at night. Since we got the 13, let's see what happens. But the next thing I need to get is the Mac, or not, yeah, the macro lens. They got the macro lens, so then you can get super close up shots, whatnot. But I keep looking at these cameras over here making me wanna buy one. It's like in between a Sony or a Canon. I don't know, man. Like, yeah, the Sony is good for, you know, vlogging and stuff, but I like to take photos too. So they got Canon over there. Oh. But yeah, guys, I'm gonna test this out tonight. You guys are gonna see. So stay tuned, stay tuned. All right, guys. Got back and got El Pollo Loco again. The lady, the lady heard me say how I thought the the mac and cheese wasn't that good, so she she gave it to me for free. She's like, Yelp, give me a Yelp review. Cheers. Trash. I'm gonna still eat a little bit of it, but it's trash. It needs seasoning, man. This thing needs some kind of seasoning. And then the cheese is not that good of cheese, man. 
I don't know what kind of cheese you're using, but it's not good. Sorry, El Pollo Loco, but trash. Mm. But yeah, guys, we're up on a hill. Uh, Y'all know where we at. And I'm gonna spark up a blunt after I eat a little bit. And it's just one of those relaxing fucking Halloween days. Cause I honestly have work tomorrow. So I just wanted a day just to chill, take my pee test. And I might go to the movies tonight. I don't know. We'll see. But I also got the bowl. Double chicken on the game. Double chicken. I, I'm not even gonna finish this, bro. Like, I doubt that I finished this. But I just got honey, hungry. This is my second meal of the day. And then I might eat one more time. But a lot of the times I don't eat at night. You know what I mean? Or if I do, it's because I didn't eat all day. I might eat one more time, all right? We'll see. But a lot of times I might just get like a snack or something. But this shit, fire. Mm-hmm. But you gotta have the avocado sauce. This is the best sauce right here. Avocado sauce, flaming. I told her to give me three of these babies. There's just something about the avocado sauce, bro. It just hits fucking different, bro. I don't even like avocados that much. I will eat avocados. I just ate one because there's actually avocados in this thing. You see it? But I like mixing avocado. I don't really like eating avocado plain. But this sauce doesn't even taste like avocado, guys. It does not even taste like avocado. Mmm. Because of whatever other spices they put in there, probably with it. Probably has a little avocado in there, but not much. Mmm. 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 Went to Spirit Halloween. I forgot the camera in my fucking car. I ended up getting this beanie. Fire. You know what I mean? Mm. But if there's any good movies, I might see one tonight. But I don't know. I might not. Just because I got to wake up in the morning. But apparently, I get a free popcorn and free soda. So. Might have to go take that real quick. I might just go in there just to get the free popcorn and free soda and dip. But I'm gonna tell them to make that popcorn fresh. You feel me? Double pump the oil. Y'all don't know nothing about that. That's the trick at the movie theater. I used to work at a movie theater. They usually pump oil in there once and there's a button that pumps oil. But if you pump it twice, and that's what makes it like that nice golden popcorn is that oil it's not even butter it's oil so what i would do is i double pump it and then like every single like popcorn comes out almost like gold pretty much tastes hella good because i like that flavor more than i like actual like putting the butter on the popcorn after um that's just me i'm not super big on butter flavor Mmm. Busting. All right, guys. I'm gonna finish this. And you gonna see what we had next. But we for sure getting the sunset. 
you already know. So stay tuned for the sunset. All right guys, sunset time. So y'all know what that means. We just got to spark the blunt and do a time lapse. Y'all see that shit? It's going over the horizon. Cheers, guys. I usually don't hit the blunt too much on the videos, but today, got to do it. But honestly, today has been a good ass day. Beautiful, I just love that it's getting cold now. Now we just need some rain so we can, these mountains that you guys see back here is straight green, bro. But fuck it, let's toke on some green, right? but I definitely gotta get a time lapses for you guys. So I'm gonna take a couple more hits and then. I'm gonna hit you guys with a nice little time lapse. Check this shit out.
fucking graveyard, eh? Check this out. So I decided to come to a graveyard just to smoke a fucking backwood um, Halloween night. Halloween night. And I got this fucking light mod thinking that I could just attach it to my GoPro for some reason. And I can't. So I gotta literally hold the, the light on top of the GoPro because now I have to go back to Best Buy tomorrow and buy the attachment. So now we'll be able to get night hiking videos, gang. I think this is gonna be the vibes. I think it's gonna be the vibes. The quality is looking not bad, but let's get into this blunt. But this is a beautiful ass night, dude. And, sp and speaking of dead people, speaking of fucking dead people, guys, I just found out the other day that my fake cart plug literally fucking died. He got got. He got shot or something. Someone got him, apparently. So I was looking up because like how. OK, so how I get my fake cards, there's this name, this dude named um, Jose Exotics. And all of the the cards you guys see for the fake cards versus the real cards, I pretty much get all my shit from him. Even the fake cards I just try, I get them from him. And I know they're fake, you know what I'm saying? Hold on, guys, I'm just trying to ashes. And I know they're fake, guys. I know it's fucking fake. So basically, I hit, try to hit him up, but I couldn't hit him up. So I hit up someone that that the dude know. I hit up something that the dude knew, and he hit me up saying, "Bruh, he got got, he got some." So basically, in my head, that's like he said he died, he got got. So someone either shot him, stabbed him, killed him. Period. He got murdered. Um, and the funny thing is, okay, it's not really funny. I don't really want to say, guys. I don't want the guy to be dead. He was selling fake cars. That's fucked up. But I don't wish death upon no man. You know what I'm saying? About I'm on no man. But um, so how he died. Or that's not how he died, but I guess people have been trying to get at him for a while because the last time I got a card off of him, he literally was talking to me about how he literally um someone over there? Oh shit. Oh, somebody scared the shit out of me. There's other people in the graveyard, guys. I really can't see them that well. But there's someone in the graveyard. Oh, shit. But let's say, okay, where was I at in this story? Okay, when last time I was with him, kicking it with him, he literally was talking about how like this dude was trying to get him trying to shoot him kill him pulled out a gun on him everything and he said it was because um he cheated him or he's the guy said he cheated him on some stuff which in my opinion it's probably true he probably sold him some fake shit some bad shit and he's trying to like get away with it you know what i mean but um, it sounds like dude finally got him. And he told me, cause I was like this, I was like, bro. Cause bro was balling, bro was making some dough. And I was like, I was just interested. I was like, how do you, how do you get into shit like this? And he was like, bro, you don't want to get into this shit. Just like, not that I was going to get into that shit type of shit. I, don't, I would never sell fake cars to people. I would always want to just sell the real deal. But he was telling me how he could sell the fake and make a lot of money because i just like the whole money aspect but he was like bro trust me this shit is not safe it's dangerous all this and <laughs> he was right <laughs> that shit's dangerous so don't be selling them fake carts out there guys
Oh, graveyard shit. This is like old history. Their names carved, weathered in stone to fall. Murray, Dolan, Doherty, Cove, and more. Pioneers all still resting forever, calling Dublin home. So these are the people that like basically fucking um, founded Dublin. Gang, because we're at a Dublin cemetery. Big doinks. But let's go cut in here real quick. Hold on. I wonder how good it is. It doesn't show that much good. You have to get, the only thing about it is you have to get really close with something to see it. Like I would have to get this far close to the gravestone for you guys to see it and actually read it. That's the only thing I would say that sucks about this light, but we also got the Henny. And this is some cold ass, look how cold this shit looks. So let's take a shot of Henny for my B-Day, man. If you guys are out there, take a shot with your boy. I know we are, we're mainly stoners, but every once in a while, we gotta get crossfaded, right? So let's get it. Let's get it. And we, let's pour one up for this guy. Schollerts. His name was Schollerts. Arthur Williams, the Schollerts, I guess. Arthur William and Terrell Gregory. Loving wife and mother. Born in 1933, died in 2017. That's crazy. Damn, they was born hella years ago. Well, I don't know if they were good people. I don't know if they were bad people, but let's pour up for them. Looks like he was in the military. It says US on that medal and it's a flag. Shot for Arthur and Terrell. Terrell? The Schoolerts. The Schoolerts. If that's how you even say their name, RIP. chase it I don't care what you say it does taste smooth going down but that shit tastes like ass no I'm just kidding it tastes pretty it doesn't taste bad but I'm not an alcohol drinker so that shit ain't good bro. give me that blunt give me that blunt the blunt's better. Let's take another hit. But yeah, guys. R.I.P. <clears throat> it's crazy the dates on here, man. We got people from 1922. Let me see where these niggas are at. Oh, shit. Damn, homie was born in 1902. Both of these guys born April 30th, 1902, or yeah, April 30th, 1902, and then March 17, 1902. What? And then, damn, this person was born in 1937 and died pretty recently. She lived a long life. Ah, damn. Some of these people actually made it to uh, to some good years, bro. They got to see uh, technology change like crazy. Oh, I can't be leaving my fucking my drink. Cheers, guys. But it's crazy walking around here. It's dark as fuck. I'm honestly just walking because the light is like blinding me. I'm literally just walking in the in the dark. I 
Oh wait, shit, I forgot the Hennessy. I forgot the Hennessy. I don't even How do you think they put the flowers there, bro? Nineteen thirty seven twenty twelve Kelly. This one has a bunch of angels. All right, let me get my hand see. And I feel like I'm being a little disrespectful just stepping on these people's stuff. RIP though, you know? RIP. All right, one more sip of Hennessy. Mm. Oh. oh, God damn. Fuck it. We getting faded tonight. All right. You see that blunt? What will we find in the door? Yo, this is so cool. I want to bring something and put it behind this door. All right, we were just walking around seeing, just looking at tombstones, it's funny. But Doobie, let's get the fuck out of here. We gotta get out of here. We gotta get the fuck out of here. Oh shit, let's go. But I think the oldest, the oldest one I saw, the oldest tombstone when they were born, it was like 1856 or something. 1850s, 1840s, something like that. Damn, can you see? There we go. I couldn't even tell if you guys could see me or not. But let's go.